Hey, what's up? Let's discuss staying above the ball. You might have heard this a lot. I grew up the whole playing career. Many players, conversations I've had with other players. We've tried to work above the ball. So what does working above the ball mean? If I get to my position here, my hands in my stance, right? As you can see, they're already above the ball, right? So as I start to go to the ball, obviously the ball is lower here. So my hands are going to work, not necessarily down, because then if I work them down, they're gonna have to come back up to hit the ball, right? So I want my hands to really go above the ball at all times and stay to where I can get, if I were to make contact here, I get a little closer to the plate. Right? If I get here, if I go to, this is a more of a higher fastball, it's above, a little bit below my shoulders and above my hip here, but my hands at all times are above the baseball, okay? If you find yourself, especially on higher pitches, and your first move, you get here, and your hands are still down here, my hands are now almost level, they're probably below the ball, I'm gonna have a very difficult time of getting to that pitch because I have to get my hands back up above it to hit it. Okay, so the mindset and the mental approach is no matter where the ball is, your hands are always above the ball. The only time that they're really not is if you decide to hit a pitch that's up here and your hands are so your hands can either get as high as that pitch or you just decide to tomahawk it, which obviously we don't recommend you do that because it's not a it's not a strike. But the hands, as you start to go toward the ball, your hands gotta go straight this way or above it. Now, if it's a little bit away, obviously my hands might stay inside it and go there. But my barrel is going to stay here and start to approach it. It starts to level off my back shoulder. And then my barrel is in the hitting zone the whole time. But I'm not focused on my barrel. I want to know where my barrel is. And I know where it is because my hands are the only thing that are connected to the bat. So if I think about my hands driving this bottom knob and my bottom hand to the ball, staying above the ball, I know my barrel is back here and I know I can let it come to this point at contact. I don't have to think about dumping my barrel, about turning it deep. I don't have to think about any of that. If I get my hands to the ball as I rotate, I'm in a really good position. I'm staying behind the ball. My hands aren't dropping to go up. They're not staying up here to chop. They're in a straight line. If I were to draw a straight line right here, they're above the ball and my bat, my barrel will find it with my top hand, okay? Top hand is so important. I don't need to drop it back here to get to it, okay? I don't need to try to whip it or snap it there. All I gotta do is just take it right to it and go through it. So think about the hands mentally, they always stay above the baseball. That's one of the best tips I can give you, hands above the ball. I'll see you in the next video.